the first one let's say we have a meeting which has been set up meeting has been passed and we also have the recording of the meeting to be done so how do you get the join URL so in the meeting request when you click on join meeting now the URL which you get is basically your join web URL this is the meeting URL so we will use this URL to first get us the first uh, API endpoint calling okay so let's do that go to your graph explorer you need to make sure that you are signing with an account which has permission to <coughs> basically consent right some of the endpoints which we are calling or which we are going to talk about might need an admin consent also so you make sure you have basically the admin rights to your uh, tenant so let's call the first api endpoint i have just copied it so the endpoint would be something called like this graph.microsoft online meetings and then we are filtering it based on the joint web url and this is where i am passing the web url which we just copied now when we do when we do run this query what are we going to get is we are going to get basically the actual meeting id 